Hi and welcome to another video from Euro Channel. Did you know that I have examined over 50,000 penises throughout my professional career? So from my own experience, I know that the thought of micropenis is a nightmare to many men and there are a lot of misconceptions about this condition. Let's get rid of some of these myths and dive right into it. Hit the like button now if you dislike micropenis. At 2000 likes, micropenis will disappear from the face of the earth. Promise. No, just kidding. But have a look at my other videos and consider subscribing if you like my content. My name is Stefan Buntrock. I'm a urologist and certified sexologist. On Euro Channel, you will get medical information from the expert. I try to balance my content into two buckets. Things every man, in my opinion, needs to know. And these are usually the videos with fewer views and things every man wants to know. These are the videos with the most views. This is a video about something every man wants to know, micropenis. And here is where the confusion starts. If you think that a small penis is called a micropenis, then you're wrong. Micropenis is a term reserved for a congenital malformation of the penis. In other words, something you're born with that happened months before you were born. Luckily, micropenis is something that affects only 0.14% of all males. It usually occurs in fetal life. Between weeks 16 to 38, the penis grows 0.8 inches, which is pretty impressive. The fetus itself grows from 5 inches to 13.5 inches during that period. A lack of testosterone at this point will lead to an underdevelopment of the penis. There are several reasons why this can happen. Either testosterone is insufficiently produced or there is an inadequate response of the penis to testosterone stimulation. Either way, micropenis is the result. It is defined as a penis that is 2.5 standard deviations below the mean regarding the age of the respective individual. This is determined by stretched penile length. I have already uploaded a video about how to do this. Now, 2.5 standard deviations in an adult will be 3.7 inches. In other words, if measured correctly, an adult penis of less than 3.7 inches in the stretched state will be considered as micropenis. Since the diagnosis is made in childhood most of the time, one has to consider the normal values for the respective age. For a newborn, stretched penile length less than 0.7 inches would fall below the 2.5 standard deviations. And for a 10-year-old, it would be less than 1.5 inches. Many men are afraid they might have penises that are too small, while in reality, this is not the case. There are so many false beliefs about normal penile length, which are mostly shaped by pornography. Truth is, most men are average. Only 10% of all men have penises that are longer than 5.8 inches when erected. And women don't really care anyway. Research shows that men who are dissatisfied with their penises outnumber women who are dissatisfied with their partner's penises by far. So what can be done about micropenis? Diagnosis should be made as early as possible in childhood. During childhood, testosterone supplementation might be tried as it will successfully stimulate penile growth in some. It depends on whether it is a problem in androgen production or a lack of responsiveness in the target organ. I know what you're thinking now. Don't. It won't work. In adulthood, testosterone supplementation will not increase penile size. On the other hand, your channel will increase in size if you hit the subscribe button. Do it now and you will feel the power of enlargement. Okay, what about surgery? Yes, it's an option, but you have to keep in mind that we are talking about a functional organ. While breast augmentation is easy, surgery on the penis is complicated. Nerves, blood supply, urethra, corpora, this all has to work somehow afterwards. With surgery, complication rates are high. So bottom line is, if you think that you are having a micropenis, you probably don't. Get a measurement first and then decide. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.